Hey everybody, hope you're having a fantastic day. We are reviewing the kids drone, the M2 LED uh, kids drone. We're gonna show it off, uh, check it out. We're gonna take it for a test flight with my co-pilot here who's gonna be uh, uh, testing it out. Uh, today we, we have charged it up, it's ready to go, but I'm gonna show you what's in the box. First of all, this is, when you unpack it, this is what you should expect. You've got a controller, the drone itself, uh, two batteries it comes with, a USB charger, a micro USB charger, and some extra propellers, parts, and a screwdriver for putting it together. So just to show you how it all uh, connects. Uh, first of all, here's the controller. Pretty simple. Uh, it takes three AAA batteries, which don't come with it, that I have added uh, already installed here. It's got a power button. It's got a uh, takeoff and landing button. So actually you can use that to take it off or you can use the controls. It has a speed adjustment. It has uh, three different speeds that it can travel in and it can roll as well. I'm gonna talk about a few things that I really like about it as we get going, but here is the drone itself. It's uh, quite petite, just a, a, a cute little thing. Kind of fits in the palm of my hand, just like that. Hold it up to the camera there. Uh, here are the two battery packs that it comes with. Battery pack one, battery pack two. I believe this one I have charged. This one still needs to be charged. You charge them for about an hour, by the way. You charge them for 60 minutes. It has some lights that light up. And then 60 minutes of charge will last about five to seven minutes of flight time, or so it says. Uh, so the installation of the battery, I'll show you that really quick. It's, uh, it's actually a cute little design, but the battery just uh, snaps right into it like so boom and then you just hear it click now the battery is snapped in uh, some things i like about it it's got these cute little propellers and some nice strong um <clears throat> uh, guards some propeller guards so you can fly it indoors without too much fear of running into stuff uh, but without further ado here are the extra propellers and the screwdriver it comes with but we're going to move all this to the side and we're gonna see if my co-pilot can take her first flight. I'm gonna go over the process of a first flight as well uh, with her. So first thing, let me let me show you how to get it started. First thing, there's a power button, and it has to pair with it too. So you turn the power button, the the, the drone starts blinking. We'll set it over here where you can see it. Move my camera back a little bit further uh, so where you can see it. Okay, so here we go. So we're gonna. First, go over the pairing. You have to connect the two together. So first thing you do, you turn the drone on and the little lights flash on, that light flashes. Then you turn the power on and then what you're supposed to do next is uh, push down and then up on it and then it beeps and then that light should turn on that it's paired. So then you push the, the flight button and then to start it, we're gonna put left and right at a 45 degree angle. Well, now it's paired. Okay, now it's paired. So right to a 45 degree angle, you can start to hear the uh, propeller start, and then you can either press up to get it started. It is pretty cool. Okay, we're gonna see if we can just hover in front of me. There's the drone. Kind of goes, it's really cute. Kind of cruises around. We're gonna test out, we're gonna test out some of the things here. That is super fun. 